All right, so as you can see, I've hit some of the frame sections with the wire brush. Good solid frame, no issues to speak of really. Um, no rusted through spots. I did go ahead and remove one of the body mount pedestals here. It was riveted in. As you see, I've, I've put a little bit of black can primer on there just to protect that bare metal surface uh, temporarily. But as you can see, I've ground all the uh, rivets down and essentially the easiest way I found to, to get them off was to just take a cutoff wheel and, and, and cut off the top of that rivet and grind it down and, until that uh, body mount <clears throat> uh, breaks loose from the frame. Um, my plan is to go ahead and tap this all the way through and then uh, sleeve it. I'll put a sleeve all the way through and tack weld it on either end. And then I'll run my bolt through and have my nut and lock washer combination on this end. And that way, when you go to tighten it down, um, you're not gonna risk uh, squeezing the side rails together with all that pressure. It'll, all the pressure will be on that sleeve that's going through. And uh, that way you'll be able to really torque down that body mount and get it on there good and uh, not have to worry about coming loose and not have to worry about compromising the, uh, the frame. Uh, as well too, if you know if there's ever a need in the future to replace one of the body mounts uh, due to collision or, or something else, um, it'll be a nut and bolt combination as opposed to something riveted on or opposed to something uh, welded on. Uh, it'll be a lot easier to deal with. So I've uh, got a few more left and uh, so far so good. I'll have uh, more videos coming soon.